so let us solve one more theorem or let us just go through the one more theorem now the equation to the pair of lines passing through the origin and perpendicular to ax square plus 2hxy plus by square is equal to 0 is bx square minus 2hxy plus ay square is equal to 0. So, this is also one of the important results for the all the competitive entrance examinations. So, here very simple technique you can remember interchange a and b coefficients and change the sign of x y. See in the place of a b comes in the place of b a comes and the sign of 2h will be changed here. So, that we get the equation to the pair of lines passing through the origin the which is perpendicular to the given pair of lines a x square plus 2 h x y plus b y square is equal to 0 is given by b x square b x square minus 2 h x y plus a y square is equal to 0. So, now let us solve it now. The proof follows like this proof. Let a x square plus 2 h x y plus b y square is equal to 0 represents the following lines, the following separate equations as following lines. Let us say one is L 1 x plus M 1 y equals to 0 say equation 1 and L 2 x plus M 2 y equal to 0 this equation 2. So, we have L 1 L 2 equals to A L 1 M 2 plus L 2 M 1 is equal to 2 h and m1 m2 is equal to b. Now, the equation of the line perpendicular to 1 is simple logic you can say m1 replaced by l1, l1 replaced by m1, change the sign. So, we get like this m1 x minus n1 y sorry l1 y equals to 0. This passes through the origin itself only. Equation of the line perpendicular 1 and passing through origin. Passing through 0 comma 0 is m1 x minus l1 y is equal to 0 say equation 3. Now, so let us write it. The equation of the line, the equation of the line, equation of the line perpendicular to and passes through or passing through, passing through origin is given by. So, now m2 like this l1 and change the sign like this. So, we get now m2 x minus L 2 y is equal to 0 equation 4. Now, we need to find out the combined equation of 3 and 4. That means, in order to get the combined equation, it is very simple. We need to multiply these two and we have to simplify it. The respective L 1 L 2 and L 1 M 2 plus L 2 M 1 and M 1 M 2 values are to be replaced. So, now the combined equation of the combined equation of 3 and 4 is ok. We can write like this m 1 x minus l 1 y multiplied by m 2 x 
minus l to y equals to 0. So, now let us simplify it. Let us simplify it. Now, what do we get? m 1 x into m 2 x m 1 m 2 x square m 1 m 2 x square correct m 1 x into minus l 2 y minus l 2 m 1 x y next term minus l 1 y into m 2 x minus l 1 m 2 x y minus into minus plus. So, we get L 1 y into L 1 L 2 y L 1 L 2 y square plus L 1 L 2 y square is equal to 0. So, before going to substitute the respective values let it be minus x y taken common. We have m 1 m 2 x square minus of this will be L 1 m 2 l 1 m 2 plus l 2 m 1 of x y plus l 1 l 2 y square is equal to 0. So, now l 1 l 2 a l 1 m 2 plus l 2 m 1 is 2 h and m 1 m 2 is equal to b. Let us substitute the respective values. So, therefore, b x square minus 2 h x y plus a y square is equal to 0. So, this is the required equation. That means, so if you want to find out the equation to the pair of lines passing through the origin and perpendicular to a x square plus 2 h x y plus b y square is equal to 0 means just interchange like this and change the sign of this one plus changes by minus. Now, what is the answer? You expect it b x square minus 2 h x y plus a y square is equal to 0. It is a very simple. So, in the simple manner the competitive entrance examination problems will be cracked. So, better to follow these kind of strategies while attempting the questions in any competitive entrance examination related to the mathematics.